Hey guys, welcome back. So, um, yeah, this channel's been pretty dormant because I just haven't had time to put what I want up, guys, because I'm constantly on my Minecraft and Let's Play channel. That does take a bit more time than I expected. Um, also, I've got a tendency of playing music a lot longer than I need to when I should be doing these videos. Um, I guess it is what it is, guys. I think I might be a little addicted to that stuff and maybe a bit to my phone. So, yeah, um... Yeah, anyway, guys, I just wanted to talk about the latest game I ended up downloading from the um, Xbox Game Pass, which obviously you probably know what it is. Because if you've seen the, um, the pre I think the previous video, it's basically that game. So it is Call of Duty um, Black Ops 6. Now, I wasn't expecting much when I, won when I went into the game. Um, I've got to stop doing that, guys. My mind is thinking and my mouth can't keep up. So I just gotta make sure I don't get too far ahead. Um, but yeah, anyway, guys. Um, yeah. So playing Black Ops Six. Now I wasn't expecting much from it because this is a Call of Duty game, which we all know Call of Duty has been pretty um sucky for the last oh several years, I'm assuming. Um, I haven't played it since Offense, Offense Warfare, I think it was. So yeah, I wasn't looking. I wasn't expecting um anything spectacular. But. To be honest, I actually surprised at this one. This one's actually pretty good. I've only played the first, the first act or the first mission or what do you want to call it. Um, so that is a pretty short intro into it. Um, the controls for it is pretty much exactly the same as all other Call of Duty. So getting into the game is not the hard part for me. Um, so staying alive, well, that on the other hand is a challenge in itself because I have a tendency of dying a lot. So, um, hey, when I used to play the old Call of Duty, so I got the Xbox 360, and when the first day first started coming out, I was actually pretty damn good on them ones, but for some unknown reason, I suck at the modern Call of Duty. So when I play them, like, on me, um, the game, my Let's Play channel, I sometimes die a lot. Um, but I'm getting to it now, guys. I'm getting more into it and I'm working out the mechanics and the um, works. So, some of the moves you do, guys, is interesting because, like, when you go to crouch in the ground, try to stay low so you don't get hit, um, that actually takes a few moments to actually work and you actually have a whole animation for it, so it doesn't happen, like, instantly. So, it takes a few moments, so you got to work that out. Um, I noticed a normal mode, or at least the mode I'm using, um, you can take a lot, you take less hits to get killed or pass out or whatever you want to call it. Um, did not like that too much, but it's just only the second, the second, um, difficulty, guys. There's four difficulties and I clicked the second easiest and yet I'm dying like 60 times. So that shows you how bad I have, I am at Call of Duty at the moment. Um, saying that, so I've been going through the last phase, I've been getting better at it. Uh, working out, you know, playing, working out the best way to avoid things. So obviously, taking cover helps you. Know, um, hiding behind things like mountains, buildings, cars, and so on. So yeah, I'm getting into it, guys. I really am getting into it. I haven't played the multiplayer. I probably won't do one too much on that on the um let's play until like near the end or something. But as far as I can see, guys, I actually enjoyed it. I think the story's pretty at the moment not too bad. I mean, it's based in the um, Cold War, so Iraqi and not just the Cold War, normal Cold War, Russia, but you know, the Iraqi War as well. Um, not to, don't not the one with the uh, the current one, the one that was a few years. I think it was the one before that. Um, but yeah, it's actually a pretty good one, guys. I enjoy all the characters. Our characters seem to be um interesting. They all have their own little quirks and a little business. Actually, when I was looking at the sim set. The similar, the movie, you know, the videos, um, they look really, really good. I, for a moment, guys, I thought I was watching a movie. I even said that in the video. Uh, yeah, it just looks fantastic, guys. They just, the way they've done the graphics with the, um, movies and the cat screens and all that kind of stuff, I think it looks really good. Um, I, and I'm playing this on a, my computer, which has the world's dumbest screen. Older screen, I should say. So this screen, guys, is like, I got it in 2005, so... Work it out. It's 19 goddamn years old. I think it's time to replace it because um, I'm not sure you probably noticed in my Let's Plays, at least if you watched any of them. 
Um, this screen doesn't display Doctor Dark very well anymore. So, um, I can't always tell friend from foe, and I can also can't see the foe because it's too dark. It just looks, it just matches with the um, background. Um, so yeah, I might have to get a new screen so I can play better game, the games, newer games without that much difficulty. Um, so yeah, that's a bit of an issue. Um, it's not so much the game issue, it's a, obviously my equipment issue. Um, but other than that, I actually enjoyed it. I feel like the game, I feel like the, the um, weapons are really good. I can feel the feet, um, feedback in the controller. I mean, I think the control is pretty damn good. Now, the only issue I have it with it is you tend to run out of bullets really fast and you've got to keep stealing ones you find on the ground. I don't know if that's something they've been doing recently, but I do remember back in the day they didn't really do that, but now they do, so... That's something kind of learning a, uh, a learning experience, so get used to doing that kind of stuff. You know, going to buildings one by one, um, working with the squad, even though they're just AI. And I actually noticed, I don't know if it's just me, but I noticed that AI is actually pretty damn good. For the most part, I mean, there were a few instances where they screw it up. So sometimes you get really ahead, and then you run into new enemies. Um, you got not, they'll just shoot, the enemies will shoot you, because your, your allies are miles behind you. Um, so you just got to be careful with that. So once, if you find your area, um, beat up, shoot up to one character, and then run back, wait for your team members to show up, and then continue, because they'll, they'll make life easier. Um, but yeah, guys, I enjoy this game a lot. This is not a game that I'll just sit on my ass not enjoying. But yeah, I just say, guys, give it a shot. I mean, it is what it is. I enjoy it, and that's what matters. I hopefully beat the game in a few, probably about a week or two. So hopefully we can um, put something out about it soon. Cheers.